Okay. The pattern that we had developed. Huh? We went ahead and we cut a prototype of the mask. I'm putting it through the final stages now. The top stitching. Two tone. Mm. It's a simple mask to make. Oh, that's your mask. Don't do that later. Two ply or three ply. High count yarn is best. More compact. This one is from Erin Bone, 100% cotton. And 12 denim, 12 denim, medium weight. This coronavirus thing gonna linger in America. Maybe we need to sell some masks, but our mask is extremely reasonable. All right. of it on the page I hope you like it it can be done in any color combination you want or any fabric combination silk and cotton together raw just straight silk you know just straight cotton patterned solids you know any type of print any fabric that you want It's highly detailed, it's more about kind of comforting your face. I went for a lot of curves and stuff, curved around the eyes, you know. As I was saying, the standard surgical mask maybe not for everybody but when I wear them it tend to you know running up pushing up in my eyes and stuff so I just wanted to see if I could create a mask that would be a little more comfortable you know you can wash it every night or every other day or over, over time you want to wash it just wash it you know so you don't have to worry about having to keep a place in disposable mask
Father, let, let her, let her talk to you. Father, huh? turn around to you. Well, later, let her do by this thing, pull the bag like she's done. Let me put the part of me do the bag. Mm -hmm. Later, to fold the shit up, I'll put the very neat inside. Sure. Understand? Very neat. If not, the final one will be good. Because it will take out the number one, it will clean. Okay. Previous mask, I put them on when I breathe. My glasses get foggy. Now with this mask, 
because of the shape that I put inside here. And I breathe. And the hair that comes out of my nostril, it comes down and then get expelled down here as opposed to going back up and get the glasses all tagged up. So you can see. Your mask, you're gonna pick that lady. Very, very simple tie in the back. You don't even have to tie no bow, just pull it. Put it on, one, boom, and it's ready. Under the ear low tie, under the ear if you want to, see, tie under, or uh, if you want to, so you can tie it. Yo, you there. So I just submitted a pretty scene. And decide. See? See how high I can lift it. And I'm still able. Be careful, may burn with the iron. I'm not worried about, you know, the thing getting up in my eye. This was my main concern right here. This is where I developed this mask. It's going to across here. That was important. I said, be careful, may you burn with the iron. Yeah, get down, man. Right. I think it's a cool mask. What do you think? Huh? Okay. Yeah, I think it's a cool mask. Huh? Okay. Well, the pattern. Very, very simple. Cut on the fold. And then the strap, you can extend it for as long as or long over long you want it. Once it's cut in the fold, you see that shape, a quarter inch seam allowance here. And then 
open and flat stitch on the outside is flat stitch on each side of the seam the seam is spread open wide but before I spread it open wide I made sure that it's stitched twice double for strength and durability then it's open and stitch on both sides flat okay all right once that is done open the same process goes for the inside piece this is a two layer then open sandwich together stitch all the way around but on either side you need a one and a half inch opening here where you would turn or bag it out you understand turn it inside out okay it sticks on the wrong side then you go ahead you think this smooth out the seams then you flat stitch one eighth of an inch starting from where the opening is close the opening all the way around all the way around the inch and a half opening stays here it bags out through here and then you after it's bagged then turn it right inside out you go ahead you go ahead and flat stitch top stitch one eighth of an inch all the way around all the way around all the way around all the way around back to the opening tack back stitch press and you have a very nice comfortable mask you can wear you can use a regular house sewing machine as a matter of fact if you're very very good with your own hand you can use a needle and thread and do very small stitches okay very small and stitch oh, like a soul look right so there you go you could make your own mask all right but it's important that you do wear your mask all right all right Let me see. Come, let me see your face. Huh? Come on. Let's try it for you. Yeah. Is it okay? Okay. Okay, come on. It's a little big for her, but see, still okay. You only want it down here. That's not too high. Too high, right? Right. So, anyhow. Yeah. Yeah. This is a this is a adult size mask. Okay. So now this one is cool, okay? This one. That's your that's your mask. Yeah. Okay people, that's it. Uh, that's it. Very high, don't talk with you, man. Don't talk with you. Okay. Don't don't talk with you. 
I hope that I, I hope I've helped some of y'all to be able to make your own mask. Once again, the shape, this contour, this right here is what's important. This is the most important thing about the mask. Okay, comfort right along your eyes. All right. Okay. Thanks for coming into my studio. Designers way. Designers ways. Designers D E S I G N E R W A Y S. Designer ways. YouTube. Okay. I'll be doing different different things and posting ideas how to help you make your own wardrobe. All right. I hope you are join me. Bless y'all. Wear your mask, okay? Stay alive. All right? Okay. Hey, I'm not going to solo the video. I don't have a mask on my eye.